Over there, you'll see uh, Rabina Sharp there, former Miss YTV, I'm sure you will remember her, and she has on those trays there uh, a lot of numbers all face down. On the very top row are the numbers 25, 50, 75 and 100. On the other rows, there's just uh, numbers of 1 to 10. Now, each contestant uh, can choose six letter six numbers and stick them on the board so uh, Alec would you like to choose your six numbers may I have two from row one uh, one from row two one from row three and two from row four right Rubina will now stick them on the board and we see what we've got and then I'll tell you what happens next four seven eight five, seventy-five, and fifty. And now Rabina goes to the fruit machine and she gives it a good tug. There it goes. Five, four, three. We, we better say three. Five, four, three. Now that's the target figure. Now what I want our contestants to do is using the numbers that Alec has picked by any process of uh, conventional mathematics, addition, subtraction, division, multiplication, to arrive at that total of 543. And they have 45 seconds to do it. The countdown starts now. very much indeed. Now the target is 543. Alec, uh, what have you arrived at? Failure, I'm afraid, 542. You're, you've got to 542, and what have you got to, Joyce? 544. 544. So no one has actually got it yet, but let's just see how you got to 542, Alex. Uh, the product of 7 and 75 is 525. Well, yes, hang on, just go a bit slow because we've got uh, Angela Garbett here. She's from Bradford University, a mathematician par excellence, and she's going to check it out, OK? Uh, plus 4. Uh, plus 8 plus 5, which is 13. There we go. Well, that's within uh, one. Now, if you'd have got the actual, uh, if you'd have actually got 543, uh, you would have got five points. But uh, as you're within five of getting the target figure, we will give you three points. So three point there to Alec. Thank you very much indeed. Well done. Uh, now, have we used the five twice? That is, uh, uh, no. we haven't used the five no. twice. So can, nice can, we five that? can we just check that? No. I apologise. Can we just check I apologise. No. no. Okay, I yes, you, you, you needn't Sorry. use all the numbers. I it was five the first Yes, time. you needn't use all the numbers, but you can't use the same one twice. But anyway, we're in the clear now. Well done, Sorry Alec. Okay. <laughs> now then, got that out of the way. Back to the letters. We now go to uh, round four. This is back to the letters again. Uh, and we are going to have... Uh, Joyce, I think, aren't we? What, uh, what, are, your, what are your letters, Joyce? A consonant, please. Um, Z. And another one. And another. G. B. A vowel, please. And another a. vowel. O. And another vowel. E. A consonant. F. And another consonant. Right, now that's, this is the letters, this is against the clock. The first one to buzz with a completed word. Off we go. <laughs> <laughs> well, Joyce, goodness oh. gracious me. That was, that was a very quick buzz. What have you got? Uh, gazebo. Gazebo? Yes. yes. Gazebo. I suppose as soon as you see a Z, don't you think of gazebo? It's, uh, it rings up all sorts of warning bells. What about you, Ted? Would you have got gazebo? No, we've got one in the garden, though, uh, and it's a good word, isn't it? 
a gazebo. gazebo can, they, yes. can we know the origin of that word? What sort of a word? What, what was it? What's the origin of it? I don't know its origin at all. Yeah. Well, I presume it's somewhere I, I from whence you came. Well, it's not its origin. Yes. Well, that's interesting. Summer Perhaps house, so isn't it? People will, will right. write it. OK, gazebo. So how many points do we get for that? G-A-Z-E-B-O. That's G-A-Z-E-B-O. One, two, three, four, five. Six points. Six points to Joyce. Now we go back to uh, another numbers game, the same rules as in the last uh, numbers game. And Joyce, you go first this time. Uh, two from the top row, please. And four from the bottom row. <coughs> Six, one, five, four, twenty-five, seventy-five. To the fruit machine to get the target number. Eight six zero. Required forty-five seconds from now. That's the buzzer. That's 45 seconds. We have to achieve the target of 860. Is that what you've done, Joyce? Nothing like 871. Oof, you're a long way. Yes. Uh, let's just see how Alec... How did you get on, Alec? Total failure, 874. 874. So you are the uh, closer of the two, uh, Joyce, so let's hear how you did that. I did 75 times 6 plus 1 plus 5. Minus 25, minus 4, well 871 there, you were 11 away and uh, you're outside uh, more than 5 points away so we only get 1 point for there, <laughs> but still, never mind, well done. Round 6 now ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this now is a rather special round. What we have done at this time, we have got what we call our pre-selected word. Uh, Kathy uh, has got the word, the letters, the eight letters there, you can see. Now this word I want you to arrange into a word which is fairly pertinent, we think, to this program. Uh, here we go. All right, we're going to start the clock. You've buzzed already, you know, yes, do you? Sorry. Okay. Do you know as well, Alec? No, not so. No, you don't know. Well, you did buzz, uh, uh, Joyce, so then uh, we'll uh, open the... Oh. No? Yeah, OK. Yes, it's not... Right, well, uh, back to the letters now for round six in our game, the last round. And by the way, we hope you're all playing at home. Now, this uh, round six is uh, a little different. What we have done, we have chosen the eight letters. This is called our pre-selected word spot. We've placed uh, the eight letters there uh, on the display. And what I want our contestants to do in 45 seconds is to arrange all those eight letters into a word which is, we think, pertinent to this programme. So off we go, contestants. 45 seconds from now. The countdown starts now. <laughs> 